Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Please like, share and subscribe my channel. Yeah, I'm going to discuss some of the very important topic today, changing circuit and it's a video lecture. So let's start. Electric circuit. If you are given a battery, a wire, a bulb, how will you arrange them so that the bulb will light up? The diagram below shows how the battery, wire and bulbs are connected in three different ways to light up the bulb. Electric current. The bulb light up because there is an electric current flowing through it. The battery is the energy source as it provides energy to light up the bulb. The battery, wire and bulb from the path of electric current to flow through. The path through which electric current flows is called an electric circuit. A closed circuit, the red dotted lines, shows the path of electric current through the battery and the bulb. Open circuit, closed circuit. Electric circuit can only flow through the closed circuit, which is continuous or unbroken path formed by an energy source and other circuit component. A circuit with a gap is called an open circuit. An open circuit is a discontinuous or broken path. Electric current flow not through the through an open circuit. Closed circuit. When a switch is turned on, the gap in the circuit is closed. Electric current flow through the closed circuit and the bulb lights up. Open circuit. When the switch is turned off, there is a gap in the circuit. The circuit is open and no electric current flows through in any part of the circuit. Circuit diagrams or symbols. Circuit component, a battery is indicated with a symbol. The positive end is represented by a long line and the negative end by the short line. Two batteries connected one after another. Two big line and two small line. Circuit diagram again you can see that the bulb with wires. It is indicated with the round circle having cross inside and two lines outside of the circle. Switch. Open switch is indicated by this way that the two circles are having an opposite side but they are not connected to each other. Switch flows you can see the both lines uh, are connected with the two dot two dots motor you can see that there is a circle m is written so it is a symbol of motor a series circuit the two bulbs in the electric circuit below are arranged one after another this is called series circuit a very clear picture you can understand there are three different diagrams a series circuit given a series circuit and a circuit diagram is given to you now we are talking about the parallel circuit. There are three different diagrams. One which is made with the wires. Second, the parallel circuit again is made with the simple way. And the third way you can see this circuit diagram. Jazakallah for today. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.